this uh, final of the 2021 Waterloo Cup. We've got a fantastic uh, field in the uh, final, the two of them, Kasimi and All In Billy. Two great dogs have won their way through the, uh, over the two weeks of crossing into the final and uh, the uh, winner will be a worthy winner, I can guarantee you that. Two very, very smart dogs involved. Kasimi drawing the inside the bitch, All In Amy in the white and uh, he's the dog. So a bitch versus a dog and uh, they're at the uh, start. This will be a good course, fantastic course. They're both set, they're ready. Signal given, and they're on their journey. Kasimi and All In Billy. Kasimi had plenty of pace at the uh, start. All In Billy, they're very strong though. Kasimi, All In Billy, All In Billy had the lead. Uh, it's coming out of Kasimi, All In Billy trying to pick it up. Kasimi in front, All In Billy grabbing it, dives near the line. Oh, leave this to the judge. All right, All In Billy. All In Billy has run down Kasimi, who lives. Half a length, we close the length here at the uh, halfway mark, still in front of the uh, driving tower, but you can see he's getting behind it all in Billy. He pulled out another gear and he was coming very, very strongly. Tony, well done winning the uh, 2021 Waterloo Cup. We said uh, three or four weeks ago here when you produced this dog how he'd be one of the uh, main contenders. He looked very, very good, not only up the straight here, but he's a very, very good dog around the uh, circle. And uh, you've turned him out in fantastic fashion and taken out the uh, final of the 2021 Waterloo Cup. Well done and uh, a great uh, exhibition of coursing right throughout the two days. Thanks, Nolly. Um, I'd just like to thank Shay and the club and oh, and the dog for well, he just keeps coming up. You want to have a speak, go, uh, Shay? No. <laughs> yeah, no, you've certainly certainly done a good uh, a good job with him, a great job, and um, for a dog that only started coursing a few weeks ago yeah. to take yeah. out a Waterloo Cup, it's a it's a pretty big performance. Most of the dogs that I've seen Waterloo Cups have had a season some of them two seasons and uh, they can go on to win these sort of races but to start off like he has and uh, beat the dogs he's beat because we said before there's no doubt this year's field was the best caliber of dogs we have seen for many many years in uh, a waterloo cup there's no doubt about yeah. that I, I, I thought i could win the first course and i thought after that it's going to get really tough because he was on the outside and he just loved the inside and uh well, it didn't worry him being that wide today. When he beat Udar Ghost in the uh, one of the runs back, a couple of runs back, uh, he then did look the one to uh, to beat because uh, Utah Ghost would have been the uh, ruling favourite for the for the race. And um, when he was able to beat him, I thought then, well, he's got this Waterloo Cup one. But credit to the to the bitch, Kasumi. She uh, made him work very, very hard to win the final. She had a nice little break on him. She's got plenty of speed out of the slips, but he's a very strong dog, and uh, he just really kicked into a second gear about 100 metres out, and he was just too strong. Got over the top to score. Well done. Yeah. Yeah, well, when I trial him here, Gary says, well, when he gets to the driving tower, he gets into a second gear. As soon as he comes onto the d downhill, he just gets into top gear. Yeah. And he just keeps coming up. And what's in store for the dog now? Tony, where do you go from here? Uh, for the meadows, said you know it. Well, he loves the meadows. Uh, All he's got to do is draw the inside. And uh, he's very hard to beat. Well, he's very fit. He's very well. And uh, it's amazing how many dogs that have coursed go back to the uh, circle and go, not that this dog needed to, but uh, they do go very, very well. So all the best at the Meadows with him. The best of luck with the uh, dog for the rest of his career and keep up the good work. Thanks, Noel.